Namecheap's the registrar that I use for buying and managing my domains. It's the registrar I recommend in all of my courses and teachings. So I'm in my Namecheap account now. I've clicked on the domain links at the top and this then allows you to go and search for domains. So if you type in a domain that you want, let's just type in google.com, click on the search, it will come back and tell you whether it's available or not. Now, obviously google.com isn't available. Let me just go back and we'll put in a slightly more sensible domain. Let's say, let's say greenliving.com. Now the problem is domains have been sold for a very long time and most of the domains you think of will probably be taken. You can see Green Living is taken. It's given me some suggestions here. So greenliving.london. Yes, London is a TLD you can have at the end of your domain. I prefer .coms, but you can also have dev, app, AI, and there's lots of more down, down here as well. You can see which ones are available, which ones are not. You can see this was registered 1997. This one's taken, taken, taken. If we keep going down, you can see this one's labeled as premium. That one's gonna cost you 1,700 pounds to buy it, and then 15, 11 per year after that to renew it. We've got .studio, .digital, and so on. So you can use that tool to find a domain that you want. You shouldn't be paying more than about $10 for a domain. The domain that I'm going to buy is, well, let's have a look, teaching XYZ. The reason I'm doing this is I'm just buying a domain that I can use for teaching purposes and to give you examples. So we've got teaching XYZ and it's available £7.07 .07 per year. So I'm gonna add it to the cart Go to the bottom of the screen here where it says checkout. Go to checkout. Domain registration is for one year. I'm going to select for two years and click on auto renew. That means that when it comes up for renewal, it will automatically renew. I don't have to do anything. The only thing you need to make sure you have is that in your Namecheap account, you have some money in your account so that renewals can take place. You will get notified when a renewal is coming up and you can go and check to make sure you have some money in there or just go in and pay for the renewal. Who is Guard? Well, Who is Guard is a one year subscription, but on Namecheap it's free forever. So we've got it enabled and we've got it auto renewed. Don't need to buy anything else on this page. Click on confirm order. And this is where you would enter your payment details down here. I've got mine set to funds. I've got money into my in my account, so I'm going to just use the funds I have in there to pay for it. Click on pay now. Thank you for your purchase. Your order number is, there's the date, it's completed. And if we scroll down, you can see that we have the domain for two years. I'm going to copy that because in the next video, I'm going to go over to a web host and we're going to set up web hosting using that domain. But that's all you need to do on Namecheap. Once you've done that, then go to the next video on setting up the web hosting.